There you go. It's on. It's on. Okay, we're on. We were just we were just having a smoke. Can't see you. Yeah. Do you know what we want to I, talk about? I know what I want to talk about. You while well, you started off. I want to talk about new language. Yeah, yeah, you're looking at a new man right now. I'm not a new man. I'm still me. We've been in the war womb. I got my hair cut. We've been in the war womb and we've been strategizing and then we said, fuck it. There is no strategy really to any of this. But what we have to do is we have to come up with a new language. And when I say a new language, I'm talking about anyone that's speaking out about any of the atrocities going on, Fukushima, chemtrails, child abuse, ritual abuse, any of these things, you know, Federal Reserve, banking cartels, whatever it is, whatever your brand is, you're going to be maligned. You're going to have assholes online calling you, calling you out, shilling you, trolling you, bullshitting you, whatever. And yeah, we all have a tendency to want to defend ourselves, right? <laughs> anyway, new language. New language. Have you ever noticed how children don't say room, they say womb? Let's go to the womb. Womb. It's easier to say womb. We've been in the war womb. You know how they have changed that to room, war room. They hire think tanks. They do think tank shit. Well, we're way beyond think tanks because we're in the war womb. We're in the war womb. And we're creating a new language. And what you see behind us is the beginning of the new language based on the free radicals. There is a free radical painting in the back. We yeah. Work. That's Chip's work. Yep, it, it's it's true. We need a new. We are we are creating new art, and we're creating new language. It rather than rather than function at this low level vibration and defending ourselves against people calling us their words, not ours. Conspiracy nuts. Where That's did this important. term their come words. from? Their words. Their words, not their ours. Words, not our words. We're just simply we're, asking questions. We're creating. We want to know language. why they don't cap uh, Fukushima. Why we get chemtrails? Why this is going on? Why the atrocities? Why two million children get trafficked a year? We're asking why. And oh, their words. We get labeled. We get labeled. Soon no. they'll have a mental illness label for anyone asking questions. I'm saying we need to resonate at a. Our art and, and, and us as people, we have to start resonating at a higher frequency, a new language. Their language doesn't apply to us. What I've been saying this morning to you when we're talking about this, the new language and using the free radicals as a vehicle to this new language is not using any of their terms ever again because it hasn't worked, it hasn't worked in history. We've seen that the art produced in history, no matter how brilliant it has been, has not been effective. Why are we so fucking ineffective? Why are we so ineffective? We say, we say the truth, but we're totally ineffective because we're using their language. We're using their words, we're not effective. You're absolutely right. That's why, that's why we are stuck in little pockets. You're in your pocket, I'm in my pocket, Blanche is in his pocket, Kevin Annette is in his pocket. These people are in pockets. The free radicals, my vision with my buddy who dumped me, and now we are the free radicals. We are the free radicals. People, people cannot live up to the expectations. My buddy who had this idea with me dumped me. He was afraid. You're not afraid, are you? I'm not afraid, but I've, I've got all kinds of reasons for why I'm not afraid and why I'm in this. I'm in this to the end. We're going to do this. I'm just, I, yeah, we are. We're going to do this. We have, we're doing it. We're doing it. Yes, we are. We are absolutely doing it. And it was kind of an epiphany today, waking up and realizing, no, we just have to, we have to create our own language through our art, through our discussions with one another. We can't use their terminology. We can't, no. Their language. It doesn't apply to us anymore. They've, they've done. Us. They've got their think tanks, their trillions of dollars they've stolen. It's called governments, institutions, child care services. Nothing social ever gets services, addressed as much as the military complex. Now. All they are all these mega structures around us, and basically we're very simple. The war womb. 
Children say the womb, not the room, the womb, the womb. You listen to a young child saying, no, they remember where they came from, the womb, not the room, the womb. We're in the war womb. We're in the war womb. So we're creating this language called painting, art, sculpture, film, music, whatever you're doing, this language needs to come from its source. What you have, what you have understood, what you have, what I have said about you being a priori artist, the fact we do not love our children, and you have struggled to show the world we need to love our children in order to overcome everything that we're facing. How could we claim to love our children if millions on mass are not marching to Washington, London, Ottawa, why we're not in full force saying, cap the fucking Fukushima, get rid of our chemtrails, stop ritual abuse, quit being enslaved to a small group of bankers. Why aren't we en masse doing that? Why don't we love our children enough to do that? What, we tuck them into bed and kiss them on the forehead and we, we kid ourselves into thinking that we love our children? What are they inheriting from us? What are we giving our children? What are we gonna tell our children? And I'm not talking in this lifetime, if there is a, a life after this, once we hook up with our kids that we fathered or, 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 or adopted or whatever, what are we going to say to them? Sorry, we fucked up, or we were just too lazy, They're gonna or we were hate. too caught up in a, in a, in a, 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 you know, on the, on the, in the spin cycle, the, trying to make money and trying to pay for that mortgage and pay for that car that we just kind of lost sight of things and and didn't collectively get together to to fight for them. If you, you know, can't fight for your children, how can you say that you love your children? Blanche has said we will be the most hated generation. Yeah in the future in a hundred years 50 years they're gonna say yeah you remember those uh, those guys what do they call the baby boomer guys you know all that the worst of the worst ever in the history of mankind makes right. Nero makes Nero look like a fucking enlightened being you know Nero the guy who married right. his horse was is going to be considered a guy that was enlightened compared to the baby boomers Blanche has said this, we're going to be the most hated generation ever in the history of the planet. Well, I'll just add to that, I think apathy is the enemy. Everyone should get a t-shirt, write it yourself on a white t-shirt. Apathy is the enemy. Maybe. It is. That might be a good Unloved children and apathy is the enemy. So now here we are in the wall womb and we are trying to trying to for ourselves not for anybody else this isn't for you this is for him and me and anyone else that is on our side we're creating this language that is going to that is going to surpass all the language ha that has been created in history because we are now in a completely new era we're in the era of ultimate destruction it's called radiation radiating everything all the other toxicities the toxic boils everywhere on the planet. This is an era that has never occurred on this planet other than maybe, I don't know, there was a meteor maybe a million years ago or a hundred million years ago or you know when those dinosaurs were gone all of a sudden. I don't know what that was. Any idea? I don't know. Were they on love or something? Historian. We also no. don't come, we're not historians and we're certainly not, we don't claim to be the experts on any of the disasters that have been propagated against us. However, we are in the solution. And the new language, we work as artists. That is our sword, if you will. That's something that we're gifted with. That's what we do. That's what we're compelled to do. And so one thing we know how to do is to express that. We're staying on track and doing that. The new language, I'm not just talking language, your court system. So people are like, oh, we'll fight this in court. We'll go to Washington and demand the court. Those are the pedophiles running it. Yes. The, the judges guys, right? Yeah, they're, they're you're the, not going to be a judge. Pedophiles. The judges I doubt you're going to be a Supreme Court Listen, judge unless you are a pedophile. Can you tell me all those guys that turns out they're Coerce. all like major pedophiles? The Supreme Court I don't judges. know about all of them, but most of a them, lot yeah. Of them, huh? They're all are like crooked in the, or they've got something on them. With the sissies in and dresses, those sissies and dresses that run Fuck those guys. Fuck them. They're being lauded. Fuck them. We have to now 
get together and support all of those who are part of this new language. We can't use their terms anymore. And we need to resonate at a higher level. I know it sounds new age and I fucking used to want to punch people in the head when they said that to me. But I've lost my kids. My life was destroyed 18 years ago. I was considered nuts. Why? Because I wanted to know who threatened my four-year-old son. What the fuck? Did I have family or friends or anyone in Hollywood ever stick up or help me? No. Whatever my ex-wife was connected to superseded everything. And I learned then what a court system, what a police force is capable of and how fucking little they'll do for me, ex-movie actor guy, who I thought I had some power. Wow, what a wake-up call. When that collectively is against you, there ain't fuck all you can do. You're, it's, 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 it's as impotent as these assholes running around thinking they're going to get some truth by having a 9-11 inquiry. Who the fuck is going to be judging the 9-11 inquiry? Who's put in a place to look into 9-11? Well, it's the same Kissinger. fucking assholes. Kissinger. Yeah. Kissinger and his gang. Like, it's fucking useless. So, it's useless. New language means fuck law, fuck police forces. That's not going to work. It's all, it's a done deal. We need to find the people on our side. They may come from all different pockets of the population. The infrastructure that we adhere to isn't working. You can look around. This is not me or him saying it's not working. Look around. The chemical destruction on our planet is huge. And now with Fukushima, radiation is huge. It's not working, people. It's not working. It's not working. Why do you still say it works? You elect people that are supposed to do things. It's not working. You There's the evidence. I love this. <laughs> they elect, we elect politicians that never, almost never keep their promises. They lie to us constantly. And yet, talk to your neighbor, talk to anyone on the street, and it's like, well, that's the way politicians are. Oh, well. What the fuck? Oh, They're well. supposed to be working for us. It, they obviously are not working for us. And I ask people, listen, do you have many friends that are proven liars, never keep their promises? <laughs> and are always stealing from you? How long did they last? I'd be a fool to have a friend like that. Oh, yeah, uh, really? But you got, you, got, you got elected politicians that do that to you, and yet that's, oh, uh, well, that's what politicians do. No! <laughs> Fuck that! New language! And you know, the last post that Blanche did was on betrayal. That's an important post. I felt so connected to that, what he was saying. The betrayal is so, so huge It now. is, and it's, it's heartbreaking. Off, it's like off the chart. It's heartbreaking. Betrayal it's heartbreaking. is one of the worst, the worst, uh, what is that, what, what is that, like emotions, is that, is that, is that, that's an emotion, like, what, what, no, betrayal is a fact, right? Emo like feeling is one I don't know, thing. I equate what, it with an emotion. Like the is feeling like of anger is an emotion. Is betrayal? No, betrayal is like at a least fact. you catatonic. Like if I whack you like that, at least you catatonic. Betrayal is horrible. At least you catatonic. Man. Betrayal is like the it's worst someone of the that worst. you loved or someone that you cared for. What a, what a disappointment! You, like the supreme. It's like it's, horrible. It's my ex-wife. It's, it's horrible. It's, That's a betrayal. Yeah, That's a betrayal. It's terrible, the man. system betrays us. So we need to find the people on our side through the language rather yeah. that we're creating. That's right. Yeah, new language, honestly. And I feel like, you know, if I have two friends in the whole world, that's a lot. Fuck it. That's a lot. I'll have two fucking friends and fuck the rest of you. Because honestly, it's not worth it. I'm interested in having new language. That not actually this old has shit. We need Go to the courts. Oh, do this. Go to children's aid. Do this. Do that. No. It's all fucking. It's all. It's fixed. It's fixed. We're living in a fixed world. Tell an African starving, you know, oh, well, go to the UN. Gates will immunize you. Go to Hurtco. Hurtco! Hurt! You brought it up. I didn't. You I brought know, it up. Hurtco. Okay, you better. You better say Hurtco. Right. Do I, do I, can I pan over this? Can yeah, I pan sure, already? man. Today's the day the gloves are off. Oh, my God. There we go. There we go. You okay? You explain it. You explain it. I. You That's want me to zero in? Symbol of UNICEF. It has the same amount of letters as UNICEF. We Tom had a brain idea to use barbed wire to replace the leaves, which are around this icon representing UNICEF. Hurtco 
We have renamed UNICEF as HERTCO. Any African, and I'm sure any third world country um, can relate to that. It's called HERTCO. Fuck the UN. They fucking don't care about you. And and this is this is the banner. We're exposing this now. I mean, we haven't posted this. We we can change our mind on posting this, I guess. But there it is. It's called. Well, you didn't talk about you didn't talk about that. What's that? That's the Big Mouth Award, which is going to be awarded by the people who are creating the new language. That's right. We are. We That's are, right. We are creating the new language. Let's get our handshake in this. There you go. There, I got right. my hair cut. Look this. at that. He looks like a renegade now. Beware. Beware. He means business. Look at his hair. Hurtco, yes. BMA, Big Mouth Awards. Hurtco. Free Radicals, which is our artist group. We are the Free Radicals and with P a few others. And PU94. The most destructive element on this planet at this time. PU94, created by General Electric. It shouldn't be GE, it should be PU, because General Electric created this element which is destroying all life on this planet. So, I'm we, taking my gloves off. Wow. wow. I'm taking my gloves We're off. We're feeling empowered. I've got my bare knuckles, and I'm telling you, fuck you! The new language. Fuck you, you governments! Fuck you, UN! Fuck you, this system that has failed us, and worse than failing Tom, myself, and our wives or our respective families, you have failed all the children in this world, and you are fucked for that. And I don't care if you clone yourselves, if you transhuman fuckers fucking continue to create this artificial world, you have fucked the children, and for that, you will pay in eternity. Rot, rot. rot. Fuck eternity. you. You're Fuck the, you. The laughing stock of eternity, as I said. There we go. Anything else? No.